Hey guys, it's me, Sean. Not. Uh, Alright, just did a video, but I'm ready to do my other video, which is the horror block. And this thing feels like it weighs a ton, so I'm real excited as I always am. Um, they haven't let me down yet, so let's go with that. Alright, uh, beer I'm gonna do is kind of exciting now. I picked it up because the bottle looked cool. Um, and sadly, that's how I pick, because I'm getting to the point now where I just go in there and half of them I've had. So, it's called Innis and Gun. It is 5.6%. Uh, um, it's an oak-aged beer. And it says that it's carefully matured in the barrels for 41 days. And it's kind of cool. It's got, like, uh, little little signatures down there. And obviously, they're not real signatures, but still, they're approved for bottling. Um, over the ages that they've put in there, but it's a uh, handcrafted Scottish beer. It is a Oak India Pale Ale. So, like I said, a lot of information there. Um, I like the fact that they give you the information on the bottle. So, it doesn't happen often. Blah, blah, blah. Not much of a scent at all. really uh, dry. Like I said, I, I don't almost smell anything. So that's a little odd. <clears throat> Most pale ales, Belgian, American, what have you, you just use a pint glass or a mug. So, of course, that's what I got here. Let's see. Looks like we got a good color again, like a nice bright. <clears throat> uh, pretty see-through. Very clear. A lot of carbonation in there. So, yeah, you get a little bit more of a, a little bit more of a scent when you uh, pour it in the glass and they start rising. So, let's see what this one tastes like. It tasted really good at first, and then the aftertaste kind of killed it a little bit. Yeah, it tastes very close, actually, to the one I just had. Um, but, it, and then the aftertaste comes in, and it just kind of blands out your tongue. So it's a little odd. It's not bad by any means. I would much more prefer it as a spring or summer beer. But, anyways. So, uh, in case you don't watch my arcade block... It's March 4th, and this is the February block. I don't know if it's because of February only had 28 days. I don't know if it's because of the shitty weather we've been having. But um, it's March 4th, and I just got these today. So it's been hard itching not to find out what the heck has been in these boxes. But if I did that, then these videos would be pointless to do. So, um, once again, super excited about the horror block. Um always comes through. Arcade Block definitely delivered this month. Um, I liked pretty much every single item that was in it. So let's hope that Horror Block does not disappoint. We do know, well, from all the things on Facebook and what have you, that there should be a vampire item, a werewolf item, and a uh, zombie item. Uh, I love zombies, so that alone will be great, and we'll go from there. So, All right. So, pretty packed full. Um, shirts on top, which I really don't like to do. I usually like to wait. Maybe I'll just pull from underneath it since you can't see the item anyways. So, let's go for our first item here. He's watching you. Um, it looks like a fairly cheap... Slap band watch. Um, I don't wear watches, um, but I mean, you guys know what a slap watch is, right? It just boom, watch. Um, little odd. Not. Uh, I don't know. That's a little weird. But, you know, you, they got to put smaller items in there. Like I said, nothing, not everything can be great. Um, uh, 
push the location of watch piece pops out, pull crown out, and rotate crown. I just telling how to to do to do the time. Okay, well there you go. Wow, so it's literally just a clock piece, and it's like what rich. I mean, it's really whatever. It is what it is. Meh. It's okay. All right, let's see what else we got in here. A uh, book. This is crap. Bitten. The book. So, I don't read books. My wife reads books. Um, I mean, it is what it is. But it is the full, uh, at least it's the non-Spanish version. Because <laughs> it just reminds me of a story. I went out to go buy my wife a book and, uh, she had me pick it up, and I didn't even look inside of it. And sure enough, it was the Spanish version. So, um, that's kind of cool. I mean, they said they were going to start putting books in next month. I didn't feel, I didn't think we were going to get one this month. So maybe this is our werewolf item, since it's called Bitten. But, uh, or Vampire, I guess. It could be either or. I would assume Vampire, actually. Uh, but... Kelly Armstrong, it sounds familiar for some reason. Maybe she's done something else. Oh, let's see what else we got in here. Well, if that's our zombie item, I'm kind of disappointed. It's called Zombie Containment Unit. It is a barrel, a clear plastic barrel, which of something I can only assume would be like Gap. Or Play-Doh. Maybe not. Of course we have to open up and see. You can get this shit everywhere. Oh. Well that's fantastic. Um, I don't know if it's because <laughs> of the weather. <laughs> from it getting like uh, cold and hot or... It's like mucus. Like, yeah. I'm gonna keep that shut for now. I don't feel like keep cleaning up a mess. Yeah, that's that's not really gack. I don't know what consistency that is, but yeah. Horror block's kind of letting me down right now. We got a book. I don't like to read. We got a goop, and we got a watch that I won't wear, so. Uh, it's pretty sad when arcade block's beaten. Wow, we're almost done already. It's crazy. All right, what is this? This is interesting. I don't, I'm not really sure what it is. It's, <laughs> it's creepy looking, whatever it is. It is just a zombie virus. It's the little virus. <laughs> I'm not really sure. Uh, Pithovirus superbum. I don't know. Giant microbes. It's one million times its actual size. Um, they've got facts and stuff in here. I mean, it looks like it's a dog toy. Um, it's kind of creepy. They got, like, plastic things over the eyes. Like, that's what the zombie virus looks like, I guess. Looks... I don't even know. I, I got nothing to say about this. Horblock's letting me down this month. Here I am talking all this stuff good about it. Wow. All right. Ugh. We're almost done, guys. Shirt time. And I can tell you, I don't like it. Together forever. Yeah. Uh. It kind of looks like the chick from the Adams Family. Not the Adams Family. Yeah, kind of like the Adams Family. I don't know. Not really getting this shirt. 
either way, not gonna wear it. So, yeah, we'll just go with that. Wow. This one sucked, guys. I mean, I'm not gonna cancel over, don't get me wrong. I don't fucking love Horror Block. But this is, this is pretty bad. Um, of course, we've got the uh, Room Org magazine. Like I said, I don't know if they're going to stick with them again or not. Um, I did hear about this, which is pretty exciting. The uh, Child's Play Special Edition. Um, they're re-releasing all of them. I'd like to get my hands on that. Um, but yeah. I mean, Room Org's always a decent little addition to it. But the items themselves this month are really bad um, in my taste so I said in my last video I wanted to start doing giveaways I will start with this one so obviously it is a small um, but you know it's 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 stretchable it's good but it is a small and uh, you know I just want people to like and subscribe and what have you but if you can answer what shirt I was wearing in the October Horror Block und Beer video. The first person that gets that, I will send them this shirt. Um, I'll just private message you for your uh, your information. So, first person that gets the October uh, Horror Block und Beer, what shirt I was wearing during that, you will get this shirt. Okay, I guess. So, I wanted to start doing some giveaways. Hopefully, that'll arrive some incentives to get people to watch and what have you. Um, but that's about it. So. Once again, Horror Block disappointed me this month. At least next month we're supposed to get two Walking Dead items, and that alone will probably make up for what I got today. So, without further ado, like, subscribe, all that good stuff, and uh, that's about it. Enjoy your time, and I'll see you next month.